Hello, everybody. Just got my blanket in. King size from Alpaca Warehouse. Let's see if I can see Alpaca Warehouse on eBay. It's, uh, let's see. Definitely not overly cheap, but not overly expensive for 100% wool. 114 $115 with 25 shipping. It's still, you know, under the... Oh, look, this one's got an hour left on it. Basically the same thing I got. Now this is 50%, I think, alpaca, and let's see, gives you little instructions, simple stuff for alpaca or wool. It's got regular wool in it too, and it is super soft, super soft. It all started, this alpaca thing, is this hat right here. This is at a uh, craft fair. Oh, in Pennsylvania, and this is from uh, Apple Lake in New York. There's an alpaca farm, and they have all these materials made out, nice and soft. I was like, I felt it's wool. It's nice and soft. It's like nice, twenty bucks for a nice warm hat to wear it all winter. So it's been a couple months now through this horrible New York winter. Enjoy the heck out of it. So let's this blanket. I mean. Colorings. I'm gonna pause it and get it out of this plastic. All right, got some of the plastic off. There's Alpaca Warehouse. It has Gainesville, Florida. Now I ordered this. I got. I won the bid at Wednesday night. I want to see nine o'clock, and right now it's Saturday, so it shipped out Thursday. Friday and got Saturday, so I mean fast shipping, ridiculous shipping. I'm gonna say, look at the so soft. This is wait, let me do a so soft, amazingly soft, thick. Let's hold up to the light. There's one of my bright lights. Let's see if, how much? Oh, a tiny little bit of light shows through. But let's uh. I mean, it's not like inches thick, but it's definitely got some heft to it. I said this thing's probably, I think it said under seven pounds, so it's like weight of a hunting rifle almost. It's king size. Came in this huge box that I uh, posted earlier today. Kind of waited till after dinner to play around with it. I mean, it's interesting the natural fibers. Uh, let's see if I can get it to zoom in good. I mean, it's got, definitely, see, I mean, it's, you probably could rip some stuff off there. So, but it's very, very soft. It's, like, unbelievable soft. <clears throat> let's, let's compare this, uh, beautiful blanket to, uh, this one here. I got it for Christmas, which I do sleep with this blanket here every night. It's, uh, let's see, let me get the tag out. It's one of these. Made in India. This is pretty thin. But still, I mean, it's decent. I mean, I sleep with it every night. Not overly soft. I mean, it has definitely the scratchy wool feel. Miscellaneous fibers. And it's also got a... My wife got it for Christmas, which kind of shocked me. It... She does pick out good gifts, but... I mean, it's just a... A car blanket, something for a throat, you know, camp blanket, I think it was. Uh, it had a crazy, I want, this almost had like a diesel fuel smell to it. it. Took a diesel, some weird, something sort of industrial smell to it. Took about five or six washings, get it decent. But that's still halfway decent blanket. But this right here, I smell it. Oh, it just smells like. Uh, like a brand new suit or something. It just has that very, very clean, clean smell to it. Look at that stitching. That's pretty heavy string. Like you can't really pull it off or. That's good stuff. I mean, it's super warm. 
I'm sure it's super warm. I mean, so far, I like it. Am I gonna hop in a snow bake and, and try to keep warm with it tonight? Nope. But, I mean, pretty nice. Probably gonna curl up on the couch with it. Do some Facebooking, maybe. Tomorrow, get a little more test with it. This is definitely quality. I mean, for the price? You know, I, this, I mean, to me, this feels like a $300 blanket because it's so, I mean, it's like cashmere soft. Like, just want to rub your face on it soft. But that's my tabletop review. This alpaca blanket. Alpaca in Reno wool, I believe it is, like 50-50. So he's got the best of both worlds, but super soft. All right, guys, have a great night.